everyone talking about Eldritch by Pinewood. The notes in this are leather, myrrh, patchouli, fir tree, oolong tea, opoponax, smoke, pine needles, and oak moss. So as you can probably tell from that, fairly intense uh, list of notes. And I wasn't sure what I was in for because there's a like, disclaimer type of thing on the product page for this for Pinewood, all caps, this is a challenging perfume. And I wouldn't have expected them to say that lightly because theirs are very, very well done. Often I find that they're usually pretty, like something that other people would like smelling on you, but they're definitely different and they're certainly intense. So for them to really go out of the way to say this about something, I was like, damn. But I really don't find this as challenging as they make it sound. So I'm not sure what that's about. I'm not saying it smells like a designer or, you know, a gourmand or something, but I don't think it's even the most challenging out of the Pinewood lineup. Uh, but I don't mean that as a critique at all or a compliment for that matter. Just yeah, that's kind of my take on the challenging aspect of it. It's really well done. Uh, to me, it smells like someone brewing a potion and eating licorice in a cave, like a dark cave with like moss growing around after gathering the ingredients like patchouli from the forest floor. Really, yeah, interesting and unique. Not something I would say I love the smell of or that I would ever want to wear, but I appreciate like how fascinating it is that it's like artistic and it really kind of creates a scene in your mind when smelling it, which Pinewood is just fantastic at doing across the board. Good longevity and decent projection. I don't think you'd want this to project too much though. Yeah, it's, while I don't think it's as like over the top extreme challenging as they make it sound like, I, it's obviously not just something that's going to please everybody. Uh, this is unisex leaning slightly masculine and it goes for 205 for a bottle. They're x straight, so they're very, very high concentration, really high quality. Again, not something I would wear, uh, not something I wouldn't be offended if I smelled it on someone else or shocked or think it was that, you know, ew, go away or anything like that. Uh, but I also wouldn't be like blown away. I just think it's more something that it's like really nice to sample for just the enjoyable of the, the enjoyable aspects of like being into fragrance and smelling different things and like, oh, that's cool. That's interesting. So for that reason, I would recommend sampling it. And maybe you'd like it more than me if you like kind of the vibe of this, but I don't like earthier type of scent so much in terms of things that I really want to wear. But uh, yeah, I'll put a link in the description where you can get a bottle or a sample.